Hello everyone and welcome to my sister wife's bombshell channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. For the majority of her life sister wife star Janelle Brown struggled with her health and weight. In any case she accepts that her way of life changes and her endeavor with Janelle's business help her. This weekend she and her little girl Savannah Brown streamed off to an intriguing objective for another Plexus show. Where are they off to this time? Christine, Maddie, Janelle and other members of the TLC family attended outings and conventions with Plexus. In reality, when they were in Nashville in June last year, Sister Wives fans contemplated whether Christine and David Woolley covertly sealed the deal. Keep in mind that is the point at which she paraded her smooth dark off-the-shoulder dress that uncovered her extraordinary tattoo. Obviously they had a good time. Janelle Brown delighted in Nashville and it appears to be that she additionally appreciates different excursions as a feature of her MLM business. As a matter of fact, Mary Brown did well off her Lularo and the three OGs are all into making a living at this point. Just Robin is by all accounts a full-time housewife nowadays. Making a trip to colorful objections is by all accounts part of the advantages of getting along nicely and this end of the week Savannah obliged her mother. Cody Earthy Colored's previous second wives declared her outlandish objective by taking to her Endeavor with Janelle account on Facebook and her Instagram stories. Savannah, who appeared mature, stood next to her mother and the two of them appeared content. In the subtitle, the tender loving care star made sense of where they were going. Savannah Brown is mature enough to invest energy with her mother, Janelle Brown, on excursions for work. Could you at any point accept that she turns 20 in December this year? In May last year she graduated secondary school and her father appeared for a selfie. Calmer than her different kin she appears to be less dynamic via online entertainment. The young sister wives star was last seen on TLC in season 18 when she said that she wasn't close to Brianna at school. On December 7, Janelle let her devotees know that Savannah Brown turned 19 and that she had almost currently finished her most memorable semester at school. It's not what her arrangements are for the future, yet we're willing to wager that the Sister Wives star appreciates colorful, warm, and radiant Punta Cana in the Dominican Republic. How do you feel about Janelle Brown taking Savannah Brown to the exotic Dominican Republic city of Punta Cana? Are you pleased that they will spend more time with David Woolley and Christine Brown? Yell out in the remarks beneath and return here for all your sister wives news. Right after Janelle Brown and Cody Earthy Colored's detachment declaration, watchers of sister spouses have been enthusiastically following the advancements in their wild marriage. The couple traded promises in 1993, denoting Janelle's entrance as Cody's second spouse into their plural marriage. However, in December 2022, news of their separation surfaced during a special episode of Sister Wives, marking a significant turning point in their union. Fans were not entirely surprised by the information because of the tumultuous relationship that Cody and Janelle have had in the past, including instances in which Cody made rude comments to her. In order to shed light on the complexity of their relationship, we are delving into a few of these incidents in this section. In the midst of the coronavirus pandemic, Cody and Robin Brown embraced a more wary methodology contrasted with the remainder of the plural family, causing critical strain with Janelle's kids. This contention brought about extensive division inside the family setting Janelle in a troublesome position where she needed to settle on supporting Cody or favoring her kids. At last she picked to remain by her children. Cody, on the other hand, did not express much sympathy for his wife's decision. The Hollywood gossip reports that he stated she doesn't want to hear the facts. She would rather not hear it. Sincerely, I believe Janelle lacks any sense of prevention. Janelle and Christine Brown became increasingly concerned about the limited family interactions their children were having during the COVID-19 quarantine. They took the initiative to facilitate gatherings to ensure their children could connect because they understood the significance of family ties. They planned their holidays to combat the pandemic's isolation. 
Nonetheless, their proactive methodology didn't agree with Cody who became angered by their endeavors. Cody communicated his disappointment straightforwardly scrutinizing Janelle's earnestness and blaming her for being brimming with s asterisk asterisk t as revealed by Screen Rant. Regardless of Janelle's rehashed affirmations to Cody about her aims to overcome any barrier among him and his children he still had doubts and doubting of her endeavors. The continuous epic showdown among Cody and Janelle at long last arrived at a point loaded up with allegations of feeling unheard and inconspicuous, heightening the generally stressed elements between them. The breakdown in communication reveals the deeper issues that existed in their marriage. Janelle has long been regarded as the steady and collected member of the family whereas Cody typically carries his emotions on his sleeve. However, Janelle found herself losing her composure as the tension in their conversation was so palpable. At last, the trade brought about Cody blaming Janelle for not paying attention to him prior to stomping out. Cody makes a joke about his son's lack of help in this particular scene, but in retrospect, this comment takes on a more melancholy tone. Late reports from Showbiz Cheat Sheet uncover that Cody has been alienated from a few of his children, prominently Gabriel and Post, for the beyond couple of years. All through Sister Spouses Season 18, Cody was apparently irritated about his coronavirus conventions not being stuck to by Janelle's children. Following an especially warmed contention during the pandemic, Cody arrived at his limit. I don't have sons, he stated. They're all dead to me. The break with his children could have begun during the pandemic yet it had been fermenting for a really long time. Cody and Janelle end up at chances in regards to their way to deal with nurturing their kids. As pressures heightened during a warmed conversation about their relationship and occasion plans, a discussion about Christmas plans between the tangled life partners turned unpredictable, as indicated by reports from individuals. At the point when Janelle uncovered to Cody that she and her youngsters would commend special times of year with Christine and her kids, Cody became upset. While Janelle and Christine had kept a nearby bond, Cody anticipated that Janelle should stay faithful to him, particularly after Christine's takeoff. Blaming Janelle for lying and denying him a valuable family time, Cody got disappointed. Cody hinted that Janelle had a negative impact on his ability to lead effectively within the family dynamic when he talked about the strained relationship he had with his sons. I could be an extraordinary forerunner in the family and I ought to be notwithstanding their sabotaging, yet I don't have the openness to the youngsters that the moms have in this family. So having the moms support me would be what should be done, he said as announced by today. In the end, Cody's resentment stemmed from his self-centered anger at Janelle for putting her children's happiness ahead of his own. In the dynamic of Cody's plural marriage, where he shuffles associations with various spouses and a sum of 18 kids, every wife frequently wound up spending critical periods alone. Cody made a veiled reference to his belief that Janelle had developed an excessive sense of independence during one memorable episode of season 17. He said, I don't actually see it as much that she's free as that she's unapproachable. She sort of does her thing, I sort of do mine. Then again, Janelle underscored the significance of her autonomy. Over the long run, Cody held on to sensations of sharpness towards Janelle for her inclination to settle on free decisions without looking for his feedback. Perhaps of the most unseemly comment Cody made during Sister Wives included his wives' monthly cycles. During an especially warmed contention with one of his spouses, he credited the contention to her encountering PMS, evading the genuine main things in need of attention and diminishing them to obsolete generalizations about ladies' periods. Cody went so far as to say that his wife's menstrual cycles were demonic and that he felt abused by them in a shocking conversation with another polygamist husband. Janelle, specifically, was never okay with Cody's unfeeling remarks in regards to her period. Thanks for watching if you like this video so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.